Okay, everybody, we're live. Hello, everyone. My name is Kim. I'm purse tripping, and today we have these gorgeous beauties for sale on today's live. So I want you to know that everything I have for sale today is uh, once you purchase it, it's yours to keep. So please ask all questions beforehand. I ship items only within the U.S. and I use PayPal for shipping. All USPS for shipping, PayPal for payment. There we go. Um, all of your questions can be answered in the description box below the video, such as, Kim, how do I pay? Kim, where are the items for sale? Kim, where are the prices? And Kim, has this sold? Everything is listed below this video in the description box. Everything is listed for sale right now as I speak. So at this moment, it's available. So go ahead and check, and we're gonna go ahead and get started. Say hi as popping in. I appreciate you guys saying hi. And I just love speaking, speaking, talking to you. You can hardly believe you're actually going to catch a live. Hi, Anita. Hi, Mary. Hi, Eliza. Welcome, everybody. I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So first come, first serve. For the, so the first couple, two or three of you that are popping on right now, you're the lucky ones because if you see something you want, you can snatch it because my items do go pretty quick. So if you see something you want, make sure to grab it, okay guys? And I'm gonna try to keep up with the comments just as best as I can, because I do wanna get all of your questions answered for you. So hello everybody that's popping on saying hello, make sure you give me a thumbs up before you leave. Um, actually just click that thumbs up right now and we're gonna get started. So bag number one today is the Patricia Nash, which is in, the little thumbnail that you guys see. So here is a beautiful brown leather Patricia, Tash, Patricia Nash tote, all come, also comes with a dust bag. It has silver and gold studs across the top. It does have little mark right here and right here, but it's a beautiful, beautiful tote. Fits perfectly on the shoulder and well, let's see okay everybody's saying hello 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 everybody there is a zipper pocket on the back awesome because it's got a zip top closure and the inside has your like the chamois type material Patricia Nash tag zipper pocket and then two pockets over here okay measurements on this is feet on the bottom as well so we have got ten and a half by 14 and a half by 3 about 3 and this bag does it is a kind of bag this leather will scuff easily um so if you don't care for that type of leather then you will not appreciate this bag um this is my favorite kind of leather you guys know that scuffs easily shows where my favorite kind of bag and here it is for you Patricia Ta Patricia Nash tote item number one with the dust bag hi everybody how are you doing today what's on the back of the bag a zipper zipper pocket zipper compartment and then a little scuff right there okay so that's item number one item number two is my fossil wallet in black smooth leather I'm gonna turn this down a tad let's see there we go maybe that's a little better 
Hmm. Can you guys see that okay? I know, it's raining here too, Rachel, I love it. Okay, you have a pocket here that snaps. All of my items are listed in the description box. It's got a zipper compartment here. This wallet is in excellent condition. There's a dollar in it. Didn't even know that. So there is a dollar in, is it a dollar? Yeah, just found a dollar in the thrifted wallet. Good luck. What else is in this bad boy? Hmm. So those are credit card slots. And then you have an ID window. And another zipper pocket for crying out loud. Can never have enough little zipper pockets. It opens like this for more credit card slots. And then your ID window. So this is item number two, fossil wallet. have item number three and it is my Michael Kors crossbody in Satiano leather. Black Michael Kors crossbody. Beautiful use, beautiful pre-loved condition I like to call it. The hardware on this is, yikes, I can't tell. Silver, silver hardware. You have your zipper pocket. Then you have a top zipper compartment, or the main main compartment is a zipper compartment. You know what, you guys? I think I might get a light box, and instead of doing my videos like this, where you can see me, because you don't need to see me, I'm I'm nothing. I can just do a light box where you guys can see the bags, because that's really what's most important. What are your guys' thoughts on that? Just a light box with the bags and the wallet, so you can see them much better. There's the interior. Here you have a zipper pocket and slip pockets right there. And then the opposite wall has slip pockets instead. Karen, I don't I don't like being on the camera anymore. Just because it's not me you guys need to see, you know? Why do you guys want to see me? It's the bag that's important, right? Like seriously, Marianne, Marianne gets it. Why, let me know in the, in the description why you'd rather see me because this is what you guys are needing your information on. Not this, this. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, you guys? So I'm very, very seriously thinking about it. Um, yeah. So here's the leather strap and it is adjustable. Okay. No, because I try the bags on. Let's see, who's saying these? Is it the is it my customers that are saying this? Cynthia, okay. Linda, okay. You like my outfits. You enjoy seeing me and what's going on. Okay, nice chatting, shaking my head. LOL, take care. Okay, take care. Have a good day. Lady J, LOL, Kimmy, LOL. I think the light box would make the colors truer, which is true to, to what they are. But other than that, you're adorable, Kimmy. Lady J, that's the reason why I wanted a light box because I'm sick and tired of my camera. Oh man, don't get seasick, hold on guys. Okay. Okay, let's hope it stays on. You might hop off again, I'm not sure. And that, right, Karen? It's like, it would not be a video without a fuck up. Like every time. There's always a bleep up every time. Okay, well, let's go ahead and try it on then. And you guys wanna see this ugly mug. This is what it looks like on, cross a body. 
Oh, Jenny, it's a big box and it's white. And you won't see me, you just see the item and it's true color, shape, form, condition, like every little scratch and nick, um, stuff that I don't point out that I may not see, you'll definitely see in a light box. I do not, I'm sorry, uh, uh, Asia. Asia, I do not ship, I only ship within the US. A lot of people use light boxes. I think I'm like the only one who doesn't. So, I don't know you guys, it's just a thought. And I wanted to do what you guys thought was best as well. So we shall see. So this was number three, Michael Kors, you guys. Number four, look at what I found again. And plus I've noticed that the chatting has gone down a lot on my videos. Like you guys, I really love when you guys interact with each other. It does nothing for me or my channel, but I really like when I have like a family sort of community where everybody becomes friends and nobody really chats with each other anymore. So I figured, well, if it's just product everybody's interested in, then I could definitely just do product without this and this and this and just make it easier for you guys. I've tried everything lighting wise, everything. And the only thing I've got going for me is, the only thing that really works best is natural sunlighting. And right now there's not a lot of natural sunlighting because it's winter and like right now it's raining out. This ring light does not do justice. I don't look like this in real life. Um, it's just as bad. The lighting here is really bad. So guess what? Here's another vintage. All you guys, or not all of you guys, but a lot of you girls and guys are asking for the vintage leather fanny pack cross sling type deal. I've got another one for you. So, it's beautiful vintage condition. It's a very, very soft leather. This is item number four. So yeah, all in all, basically what I'm trying to do is just make it easier for you guys to see the product and um, and that. Sean, new format on your phone makes it hard to chat and see the bags at the same time. Well, that's a bummer. That's a bummer. The main reason, the main reason you subscribe to my channel is because you can see you and see the bags on you. No fun watching someone's hands or looking at some sort of box. When you did auctions and more interaction, it was more chatting, I think. I also like seeing your purse room. Mmm, okay. All right, we'll see you guys. We'll see what happens. I might do a poll. Lots of pockets on this really cute leather fanny pack slash crossbody. But... Anyways, most important is I make you guys happy because if you guys aren't happy, then I can't sell my product and that's why I'm here. So just wanna make sure that I'm making you guys happy with the way you can see the items, um, if you like seeing them on me. I know we all have different body, body shapes and sizes and things, so here you go. What do you mean, Dolores? You mean like now, or do you mean in the light boxes? You can't see the bags well. And this is adjustable, by the way. And I know somebody might want to see this one on. Um, so let's go ahead and put this one on. These are all the rage, you guys. All the rage right now. Kind of hard to see because I'm wearing a black top. Let's put this over. There. So you can see what size it is. It's a medium size. And it's really, really cute. And it is vintage black leather sling item number four. Do you see insurance when you ship? Do I, oh, do I use insurance? You will get a tracking number uh, when I ship your item. You'll get a tracking number. And so if something happens to your package and route, um, then obviously it's not my fault because it's shipped already. So you can take that tracking number and then you can file a claim with the post office for whatever reason it is um, that if the package got lost or broken or whatever in the mail. Okay, let's see. You don't know if it's the lighting, what, but it, but it doesn't look very clear. I don't know, that's what I'm saying. The lighting is such a bummer. Like I can never tell when to, when to do this. 
Main reason you watch is because I'm super cool and fun. <laughs> Love my vibe. Honest, real, and rockin'. Sean, thank you so much. Thank you so much. You really look forward to the See, now look at the light. Can you guys see that? That's because like sunshine is now coming in my window in my room here. Uh, you really look forward to them. You're like family. Aw, show the bags better than anyone else on YouTube. Karen, I love you. Thank you so much. Now you guys are making me not want to get a light box. <laughs> what if I damage your bag? Then don't buy it. Is that what you mean? If I've damaged your bag, then please don't buy it if you think it's damaged. Um, you could see the purses much better when you were using landscape mode. Oh, I'm not using landscape mode. That's because my room's too much of a, it's, it's not even what it used to be, okay? This is the only part I can move in in here now. This is it. Because it's all purses over here now. Packaging supplies over here. Yeah, this is the only part of the room I'm going to let you guys see now because it's, I need like a, my business has grown and I need like a huge, huge room and I don't have that in my house. So, okay. Next bag is going to be, um, my Kipling. Oops. Super cool. This is a gold. This is not bright yellow at all. This is like a not even coming off the right color. This is like gold. Like, let me turn this light off and see. Um, nope. Okay, so this is as good as you're gonna get on this one. But it's gold, you guys, it's not bright yellow. Is it coming off gold on your end? Let me know. It's a medium sized backpack. It's in new condition. This is item number five. Straps are adjustable. Looks like so on. Okay, good, Sean. Um, well, it wasn't damaged when I bought it. You damaged. Oh, this is um Sean Stroll, right? When you packaged it, you sold it as new. It arrived damaged. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. So what you're going to do is you're going to, exactly, I purchased it. When you purchased it, it was in the condition that you saw it in. When you received it, Lady Badger, when you received it, something happened in transport. Not my fault. It's out of my hands. You've had the tracking number. If you need the tracking number, I'll be glad to get that for you. Not a problem. And then you're going to file a claim with the post office as damaged goods. Okay? Because when you saw the bag, that's how it was when it got shipped out. And that's how it works. If you get an item that was damaged during transport, there's nothing I can do about that. I am sorry about your situation. I, I have had the same thing happen myself. Um, I've had items break in the mail. I've had... Never had a purse damaged in transport, but I have definitely had other items. And what you do is you're going to file a claim with the amount you paid, including your, sh I think you can include your shipping fee as well. And then um, you will get a refund from the post office since they damaged your item. All right. And also, um, you were also saying, uh, this is for everybody. If anybody tries to contact me through... Um, my Gmail, I don't accept anything through my Gmail. It goes right straight into my trash, you guys. I only have like very specific accounts that go into my email. So the only way to contact me is through my private messaging on Instagram, which you guys, I think most of you guys have it. It's purse tripping on Instagram. You can private message me on there or you can private message me like Lady Badger did through her payment on PayPal. So there are definite ways of getting hold of me. Um, for sure. Okay, back to the items. Nobody gives a care about the rest of it, right? Okay. So, you've got your main compartment. And it is one zipper pocket. I think. Yeah, one zipper pocket there. And then you have your zipper pocket and on the inside, look at all the doodads you have in here. I think this is a 
pen or pencil holder right there, right there. And then you have a cell phone pocket and that's what's in that pocket. And then you also have this front pocket. It's a big open pocket there. Of course, you've got your little friend here. And that totally looked dirty and it's not, look. So it looks dirty on the bottom, but it's clean, the lighting. And then this little monkey is name. If you're a name or you know anybody named Myrtle, then they need this monkey. This is Myrtle. And you, you damaged it when I packaged it. Oh, okay, so we're gonna go on to the next one now. Okay, yes, Linda, it is definitely cold, gold, definitely gold. Oh, also a key lanyard. Okay, so this is item number five, Kipling. And I do believe I stated Lady Badger um, lots and lots and lots of times how I package my items. And this is also, if you're new here, I'd like to explain as well. I do not package my items fancy with like big boxes. Um, I don't put like the bubble wrap and I don't put tissue paper. Um, I don't do any of that. I've showed you guys many, many times that I use an envelope because it's quicker and less cost effective unless you guys want to pay like $20 for shipping. And then um, for really, really big bags or like really gigantic bags, I do charge more for shipping and then they will go in a larger box, but I don't do all the fancy wrapping and stuff like that. Unless it's for sunglasses, um, you know, breakable items, then I'll do bubble wrap and all that stuff. So just want to let you guys know that again. Hey Sparrow, welcome back, welcome back. Okay, so anyways, I won't talk about that stuff anymore unless you have any more questions and then I'd be glad to answer for you. So this is this, and this is item number five. Item number five. Let's see what we've got going on here. I think I have a ghost in here. I'm pretty sure of it. Okay, my Kipling sold, you guys. So thank you for your purchase. Kipling is no longer available. All right, are we ready for the next one? Okay, so next I have my vintage black leather. Or, oh, this is so cool. Love this one, you guys. Look at the leather on this, it's beautiful. This is a large black organizer crossbody and it's in a really, really pretty, uh, between a smooth and a pebble leather. It's very very soft it's got a big o-ring that connects and snaps and that's how you undo the flap i'll show you that in just a second um it's on a shoulder length right now you know what i'm really getting tired of this thing here it's just not working for me very well i don't understand why it won't stay on it's in a clasp 
Okay, so this is what it looks like on my shoulder, and then it's also definitely can be adjusted to a really long crossbody if you want. It is a large, yes, definite messenger bag style. Oh, Sean, it's been a day. Let me tell you, it's been a day. Not a bad day, but it's been a, it's been a very, very busy one for sure. That's raw leather on the inside there, and then that's kind of like a, you know, material. <laughs> then you open the flap, and then okay, so it's got lots and lots of stuff. If you carry a, a small iPad or a small computer, oh yeah, I've got a ghost in here somewhere. I'm sure of it. And then this right here is padded, so you can fit a small iPad or laptop. You know what, let me measure this for you so you'll know exactly what size. So this one measures 14 by 15 14 by 15 probably by three it looks like yep three so 14 by 15 by three on the front you have this pocket yes they did yesterday sure did and it is gorgeous this right here you can't see it but it's an ID window Clear plastic and then in here you can't see it but uh, it's actually a slip pocket and three pin slots in that pocket then you have a zipper that goes down pretty far and then like I was showing you your main compartment where you can put your small laptop, whatever, and then a large pocket on the back. Okay, so this is item number six. Vintage black leather large organizer crossbody or shoulder bag, whatever you want. Number seven, very, very expensive bag. I was lucky enough to find. It's an olive color new buck leather. So it's an olive new buck. Do I have, I do, I do have a man bag as a matter of fact. I will show you, if you remind me, cause I'll forget, if you remind me, I'll show you the one I have, um, I do. So there's a side pocket with a magnetic snap. And look at the gorgeous leather on this. And then a snap pocket there. Brush nickel hardware, tote straps. It's a large tote. Bottoms in great condition. Magnetic snap closure. And then nice and roomy with a zip pocket. Okay. I'm about ready to call this auction off, you guys. Holy hell. Can we really get a life here, camera? You guys are just gonna keep popping off for a while because it's just life. It's just life. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Real life over here. <laughs> and then you've got two slip pockets and then a magnetic, you know, leather, color, leather covered magnetic snap on this side. I just want you to see the leather on this bag. It is too, too pretty. It's very smushy new buck. A very, very expensive bag. Hello, Brianna, welcome. So this is item number seven, Garrett Hi Garnet Hill Olive Leather Large Tote, okay?
Brighton. Let's do my Brighton now. Are you ready? <laughs> do you know how hard it was for me not to keep this one, you guys? I know. You know what? That's what keeps me going. You just got to laugh about it. It's getting a little toasty as we're doing this, too. I. That's why you guys like watching me, because I'm a hot freaking mess. <laughs> Lives are hot messes because they're live, because you don't plan them accordingly and stuff just happens, right? Do, 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 do. Look at this, you guys. This is a Brighton hair on black leather tote. Wow. Look at this beauty. Oh, that's a large slip pocket, all black leather on the back. Structured little beauty. Nice long strap drop if you like that. So, 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 so soft. This is a therapy bag if you're in the lion or something. I like fringe for therapy. I also like hair on hide. That's why a lot of my bags are fringe hair on hide bags because when I'm in line or people are on my last nerve, I just, you know, today I was thrifting and I said, you know what? I was talking to one of my good friends and I said, you know what? Sometimes people just, they just don't get it. Sometimes people just don't get it when you're out at Savers. And he goes, well, you know, uh, contact to contact is okay at Savers. I said, what? Because you're allowed to punch people here. And I said, what? You could punch people here at Savers and he started laughing and it was like, he actually had me going for a second because Savers, you never know. Savers, you just don't know, you guys. Thrift stores, you, you just don't know. Like, it's a different story every day. And he told me that, yeah, if you want, you can punch them. <laughs> I'm like, oh my gosh, you're a crazy man. You are crazy. Does anybody like this as much as I do? Because I think it's gorgeous. Yes, Lori, gorgeous is, gorgeous is buttery. Leather is buttery and gorgeous. On the green one so here's the inside there's the Brighton Creed and a zipper pocket the bottom is structured and it's raw leather on the bottom and then you have uh, two slip pockets over here okay I think she's beautiful I think she's so pretty I mean this is like one large pocket right here I don't know Maybe I'm partial. Maybe some of you guys are like, uh, no, thank you. Not me. Uh, it's a keeper for me. I love it. Okay, so that's my Brighton, and that's item number eight. Item number nine is, where are you at? Where are you at? No, for real, you guys. Okay, this is weird. Okay, stuff that I had on my shelf is literally not there right now because I have it written down as I was looking at it and it just is gone now. There's a ghost up in here. What the heck, man? Okay, all right. Well, we've got this beauty. This is the SAC and this is actually still on the website right now by the from SAC. I think it's $168 on the website, and it is still this one in brand new condition. It's a tan leather, a structured sort of leather that has woven leather on the front. Are you guys able to see this okay? There we go. Woven leather on the front, pretty little tassel detail. Got the little sack emblem right here. And it's got large thread stitching on the sides. The back is plain. Hardware on this one is brass. Here's the bottom. And then it's got, it does have a magnetic snap. Let me take all the goodies out. So it does have a magnetic snap and it also has the cinch, okay? 
So you have double security on this one. And here's the inside. And I will try it on for you. It's got adjustable shoulder strap. Okay, so this is my sack and this is item number nine. Item number 10 is, which one is this one? Okay, so this is my coach tote. This is a newer coach item and it does come with a dust bag. So you get your little sateen dust bag and then it's black with brass chain. They look brand new. Actually, the sack is, it's, it's uh, thrifted, but it looks to me like nobody ever used the sack before. So it's got pretty detail, like the leather trim on it is really pretty. It says coach right here. Nice large leather tote. Um, there's a really big pocket right here on the front and it has a zip top closure. It's definitely a smooth type of glove leather. And then the inside has sparkles in it. There's a zipper pocket, black satin interior. There's your zipper, and then on this side is two open pockets. Two open pockets. Okay. So this is item number 10. I'm gonna go ahead and put the little bag in here. Oh, is it Lori? Yeah, it's a nice bag. Stay tuned because you just never know what's gonna pop up over here. I have probably a, I don't even know, too many to count purses that I've been thrifting and I only do about between 10 and 13 a day. About 10 or 13 bags a day. So it's easier for you guys to choose. And I thought this would look super cute with it. I have this Coach wristlet wallet in black smooth leather as well. This is item number 11. It's got the metal Coach emblem on the front. It's very smooth leather, glove leather. Um, it's got the hang tag. credit card slots and then you also have this little pocket here That'll come off, that's just a little, it's not a scratch, it's just something that's always on my black leather that's white. I don't understand it. But anyways, Coach wristlet wallet, item number 11. Item number 11. Um, Mary, what you have to do, you don't claim here, you just go straight over to PayPal. Um, everything in the description box 
is listed, everything you just saw. For instance, you want item number 10, then you just go over to PayPal. Um, when you send your payment, make sure you send me your shipping address along with the item you purchased, which is item number 10, Black Coach Tote, and I'll ship it out tomorrow. Super easy. All right, and then we have the Jack Georges. You guys know these are expensive bags, and this can too be unisex if you like it to be. It's the saddle leather in brown. Adjustable strap can be a shoulder or a crossbody bag. The zipper pocket on this side. Inside of that pocket. Another large pocket. Brand new condition. And it's by Jack George's. Hi, Jillian, welcome. Okay. So it's a gorgeous marbled leather. I think it's so pretty. And then somebody wanted to see a unisex bag or a man bag. So I do have one over here. Let me grab it. So this is actually available for anybody that wants it. I'm just showing you what I do have that's available. It's a black nylon bag. One second while I see what was just purchased. Alrighty, so my Coach Black Leather Tote has sold. Thank you much for your purchase. That Black Leather Tote has sold. Okay, so here is, this is a really, really thick nylon and leather, black leather trim. It's got the comfort strap that's leather on the top. This bag is by Banana Republic. And it snaps closed. And you also have a zipper pocket on the flap. Magnetic snaps. And it's in new, like new condition. And then here's your inside. Okay, so now let's answer any questions you have. Thank you, Mary. Uh, payment was received. Thank you so much. So, okay, guys, let the questions roll. If you have any questions, now's the time. I'll be happy to answer them for you. Oh, I'm going to list this one. i got to list this one. Hold on just a second, guys. So I'm going to put unisex, Banana Republic unisex crossbody, okay? Messenger bag. Stay. And that will be item number 13 if anybody's interested.
Let's see if we have any questions. Any doonies? I do, but I'm not doing doonies today. Do you have any questions on the bags that I've shown you guys? Um, I'll be glad to answer those questions for you. But yes, I do. I do have doonies. Let's show you this. Do I have any nurses out there? This is for, maybe this is a great gift if you know a nurse or you are a nurse. So let's see if I can show you really good here. So it's a keychain or you can clip it on your purse. And this little tag on here says, nursing is a work of heart. And then you have a little red heart charm and you have um, a cross and then you also have the little ribbon that can it's cancer awareness ribbon okay I got my daughter one of these And then that's what it looks like. So if you're interested in this, I will list it right now. And it's gonna be item number 14, Nurse Charm. Okay, so that'll be item number 14. The only problem is the shipping is freaking expensive. So you're probably not gonna really wanna get one of these unless you've purchased an item because shipping's ridiculous. So if you already purchased an item and you wanna purchase this, then don't pay shipping on it. But if you do want this and you haven't purchased another item, shipping is still the same, okay? So just letting you know. Makes a great gift though. And a really cute stocking step, stuffer as well. Did you guys notice shipping went up through USPS again? Again. Okay, to um, hi, hi to shell. All right, you guys. So I guess that's gonna be it for today. You guys don't have any more questions, so we're gonna just go ahead and head out to. Take care of everything else I need to take care of today. Take care of that new puppy in there. And have a really, really great re great rest of your day. Does the sack bucket bag have a zipper as well as the drawstring? No, Lori, it has a magnetic snap closure at the top. No zipper. Magnetic snap and then the cinch. Thank you for asking, by the way. I appreciate that. Any more questions, you guys? I'll hang out for a minute if you have any more questions. Oh, you are so welcome, Tishel. Thank you for asking. Okay, no more questions, you guys. I'm gonna get going. Take care of yourselves and I will see you. Am I gonna see you tomorrow? I'm trying to think what my day is like tomorrow. I'm hopefully gonna, hopefully, hopefully going to uh, be able to come on tomorrow. Hey, you guys, do me a favor. In the comment section, please let me know what time works, for, works best for you guys on live videos. Um, of course, I'm gonna have to go with the general public on what works best for them. But I would really like to know, are you better, like, let's say 11 in the morning, three in the afternoon, my time, Pacific time. I don't know where you're at. So count two or three hours ahead or back. 
Um, just, yeah, let me know what time works best for you. When you do put the time down there, make sure you're putting specific standard time so I will know my time, what to come on, okay? All right, you guys, thank you guys so much for joining me, and I will see you tomorrow.